right? Mm -hmm. Why do you ask? I've decided that I want to be an artist too and I want to learn everything about art. Oh, that's quite ambitious. Well, I think you're in the right place. I've done art for a very long time now. I can teach you if you'd like. Yes, please. Well then, young lady, your lessons start today. Now what? Now you make art! <laughs> now you try! Uh, okay. I guess I can try. Oh... It's really quite good for your first time. But maybe we should go over the basics first. Do 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 do. Ah, yes. Let's start with this one. Line. A line is simply a dot that went for a walk. It can go in a straight line. Or it can walk in a silly squiggly line or even a zigzaggy line. It can even take a very silly walk, which is just really all other kinds of walks put together like this. I see. Does the dot always take a walk up and down? No, no. It can take a walk up and down, left to right, or even diagonally. A dot that's on a walk can go wherever it pleases. Their walks can create all kinds of different lines. Lines come in all sorts of shapes and sizes. A line can be thick or thin, big or small, just like you and me. When you're making art, this is called line weight. Oh, okay, so a dot goes for a walk, and that walk makes a line. And dots can make any kind of line they want. And those lines have weight or can be big or small, just like you and me. Yes, you're getting it. Lines can be used to make something seem more important or closer to the viewer. See? If you really want your drawing to stand out, you can add shading to it. There are all kinds of ways to add shading, but this kind only uses lines. When you crisscross lines like this, it's called crosshatching. The line is a very versatile tool in art. Why don't you try to draw something with lines? Oh, but I can't draw with just lines. What about all the other things in that book? Don't I need to know those things too? Eventually, I'll teach you everything in the book. But for today, you're just going to have to be creative. With just lines, I can make a picture of just about anything like you, or even myself. Why don't you try a continuous contour drawing, like the one I just did? What does continuous mean? It means the line doesn't stop. You can draw something with just one line. You don't even have to lift your marker. That sounds easy enough. Let me try to draw you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, splendid. What a wonderful drawing you've created. Thank you, Mr. Doodle. But I feel like it could use something more. There, now it's finished. I'm really proud of all the stuff I learned about lines today. Oh, how wonderful. You've used all kinds of lines in this drawing. Am I ready to be an artist now? You've always been an artist, Kitten Caboodle, but you'll be an even better one once I finish teaching you all things in my book. Can we make another contour drawing? Yes, of course. Mm -hmm. 